ऑनलाइन लेक्चर सीरीज बाय डॉक्टर के विदर सिंह लैंडिंग इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग टेक्नोलॉजी विजयनगर सो दिस इज द फर्स्ट लेक्चर ऑन मल्टीपल इंटीग्रल्स फर्स्ट वी विल डिस्कस फ्यू प्रॉब्लम्स बेस्ड ऑन डबल इंटीग्रल्स फर्स्ट टुडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट अ प्रॉब्लम बेस्ड ऑन डबल इंटीग्रल्स व्हिच इज इन कार्टेशियन फॉर्म सो प्रॉब्लम एवेल्यूट double integral x y into x plus y dx dy over the region r bounded by y equals to x square and y equals to x so the given region is bounded by two curves y equals to x square y equals to x square and also y equals to x so now first we will discuss about the region what is the region bounded by these two curves so y equals to x square is a parabola a parabola through through the origin symmetric about the x axis which is like this form which is like this form and this is y equals to y equals to x square and another another line straight line which is passing through origin y equals to x so the region is the combined the region bounded by the two curves is this is the shaded region the shaded region is the shaded region is the required region now first we will solve these two equations y equals to x square and y equals to x so very simple y and y both left side left hand sides are equal then right hand sides are equal y equals to x square y equals to x square is nothing but y square minus x equals to 0 and x is the common term x minus 1 equals to 0 now x equals to x equals to 0 and 1 now put y x equals to 0 and 1 in any one of the curve if we put y x equals to 0, y equals to 0, x equals to 1, y becomes 1. So then the points of intersections are 0, 0 and, and second point is 1, 1. Now observe the, the region. Hence the region is, this is parabola y equals to x square, y equals, this is the parabola y equals to x square. And now this is the straight line. This is the straight line by equals to x. And we derive two points. First point is uh, this is O, 0, comma 0. And another point of intersection is this one, A, 1, comma 1. Now the shaded region is this is R region. So in this region, we will uh, evaluate the integral, evaluate the integral. Now we will evaluate the double integral. Now what about the limits? If you observe, observe the y limits along y axis, by along y axis, the lower curve is, this is the lower curve, the lower curve is, the lower curve is y equals to x square, to upper curve is y equals to x. So the y limits are, x square to x square to x and also x limits x limits so if you observe the point of intersection here x is 0 and here x equals to 1 then x limits are x equals to 0 comma 1 now if you observe the this is the given integral double integral x y into x plus y dx dy now y lower limit is y equals to x square if you observe the lower curve the lower curve of this region y equals to x square upper curve is y equals to x then y y limits are y is x square to x then x limits are 0 to 1 x equals to 0 to 1 now first first we will evaluate with respect to y then we will evaluate with respect to x according to the uh, limits of the integral double integral Now, 
first uh, multiply these two multiply these two x into x x square y and x into y square is x y square after multiplying after multiplying these two inside integral you will get this x square y plus x into y square dy now you integrate with respect to y y integ integral y equals to integral y dy equals to y square by 2 in the similar way this is the integral y is y square by 2 integral y square equals to integral y square equals to y cube by 3 very simple formula known formula integral x power n integral x power n integral x power n dx equals to x power n plus 1 by n plus 1 using this formula we will get the integral of y square and also integral of y so after after integrating substitute the limits x square y equals to x square and y equals to x first we will substitute y equals to x in this integral we here just replace y by x here y by x and then replace y by x square with a negative sign y if we put y equals to x square, x square whole square equals to x power 4, x square whole cube equals to x power 6. Multiplying these two, x square into x square is x power 4, x into x cube is x power 4 here, x square into x power 4 is x power 6, x into x power 7 is x power 7. x into x power 6 is x power 7. After, after multiplying, you will get x power 4 by 2 plus x power 4 by 3 minus x power 6 by 2 plus x power 7 by 3 dx now here x power 4 here also x power 4 here if you common x power 4 with the coefficients by 1 plus 1 by 2 plus 1 by 3 so simply lcm is 6 then 5 5 by 6 5 by 6 times of x power 4 minus x power minus x power 6 by 2 minus x power 7 by 3 now integrate with respect to integrate with respect to x known formula again known formula x power n dx known formula x power n plus 1 by n plus 1 using this formula x power 4 integral value is x power 5 by 5, which is 6 into 5 is 30. x power 6 by uh, 6, so x power 7 by uh, 7, 7 to 0, 14. x power 8 by 8 into 3, 3, 8s are 24. Now, substitute put x equals to 1 and also x equals to 0. If you put x equals to 1, 5 by 30 minus 1 by 14 minus 1 by 24. If you put x equals to 0, this is 0, this is 0, this is totally 0. Now, if you simplify one, this one and this one, one by six times, one by six times, one by six times minus one by four minus one by twenty-four becomes three by thirty-six. Now, finally, you got the double integral value. Integral x is zero to one. Y is x square to x x y into x plus y dx dy equals to three by fifty-six. So, if you have any doubts, contact me through email and also with. WhatsApp number. Thank you. Thank you very much. Bye again.